You've watched What Would You Do? Now we're bringing you Actor After Scene, where our actors lift the curtain and reveal just what it takes to make hidden camera magic. Hi, my name is Blake Bergman, and I'm acting today in What Would You Do's Bad Bagger. Hi, I'm Mary Lorem, and I'm uh, an actor today for What Would You Do? And uh, it was um, uh, extremely funny because this go. young man was just screwing everything up. He should, he should definitely be fired. <laughs> uh, would you double back it, please? You got it. I think I have some coupons. To prepare for a role like this, I kind of, you know, get in the mindset of someone that really just doesn't know what they're doing at their job. Here you go. Oh. oh. Trying to fit everything into one bag, squishing stuff, breaking stuff, ripping it apart. Like if there was a bag of granola bars or something, I would empty the bag of granola bars into it to save space. You don't see it spilling out? No, no, look, you crack her eggs, look, they crack. I remember this one guy, he intimidated me big time. I mean, he started going off on me, yelling at me that I was doing the wrong thing. Why are you squishing me? What are you doing? Oh, it's just to get more room in the bag. You're talking about more room in the bag? Is you stupid or what? Uh, he saw what was happening right away and got very upset and came to my rescue immediately. There were some people who wanted to talk to the manager right away. You saw you blow out this person's pie up like that? So I thought it would taste the same. Stupid, man. So a lot of people really got annoyed. I th maybe because it was an older woman, and um, so I think they were trying to stand up for me, which was very sweet. You are out of control. Why are you working here? Get over there, cracking her eggs and all of that. You're not disrespectful. He needs to get fired. At one point uh, while filming, the milk broke. And um, I don't exactly remember what happened, but it just kind of emptied out everyone on the floor, causing a big break. But then the cleanup wasn't so funny. I'm, I'm learning to be a really fast bagger, but sometimes stuff like that happens. But we should be good. Shoot. Oh. All right, oh. I'm out of here. <laughs> It was difficult for me to not look at what the bagger was doing because I could hear things. It sounded like it was pretty outrageous. Brush your potato chips open. He opened them. Sound oh my like gosh! It. Definitely hard to keep a straight face. I, I wanted, I really wanted to watch. I usually am able to keep a straight face, but there was one moment where I think I heard one of the producers start laughing in my ear. I, think I had to turn away, and I was just laughing to myself, and I had to catch myself. That that's probably the hardest part to um, to go along with the story and not let them know that you're in on something. I'm just surprised people believe that I was a real bagger <laughs> because I was doing some crazy stuff, but they did. I just take it for granted that somebody's packing correctly. I, I would never, I don't think I ever even look, but I think I will now. <laughs> and I think there really is an art to bagging. Uh, some stores do it very, very well. <laughs> hey there, I'm John Quinones. Thanks for checking out our Actor After Scene on our YouTube channel. There's so much more to see. So take a moment to click on this red button right down here, the one that says subscribe, and you won't miss another What Would You Do moment.